guys, it's Justine, and wow, wow, wow. You guys have been tweeting me images of what potentially could be the next iPhone. There's been so many rumors already, and it's not even time for this phone to even be remotely announced, but who knows, anything can happen. But the iPhone, whatever the next version of the iPhone will be called, is right now we're calling it the iPhone 11, which I guess in theory would technically be a good name for the next phone, I don't know. Do you know? Does anybody know? Does Apple know? Have they actually thought of a name yet? Either way, I thought that we would just kind of do a quick little roundup and just go through and see some of the things that people are reportedly rumoring rumoring? It's going to be a while before this phone actually comes out. The first rumor and something that I've been hoping for in the last few phones is that Apple would get rid of the lightning cable and switch all to USB-C. And I think it's only a matter of time because the latest iPad is USB-C, their MacBooks are USB-C, and their iPhones are not. It drives me crazy. I just am so sick of having so many different cables. And honestly, don't even get me started on air power. <laughs> it was definitely supposed to be something that was like last year. I still have have high hopes for it. One of the biggest struggles is charging my phone, charging my watch, charging my AirPods. I still keep hoping that one day Apple just surprises us with a lovely gift of surprise. It's here. The thing that I don't like about this is it says that a more recent report claimed that the iPhone 11 phones will have lightning ports. I don't like that. This is not a change that we can expect to see this year. I think they're gonna do it. I think they're gonna do it. I don't know. I have no idea. I'm not sure. <gasps> Fingers crossed. Again, I've been crossing them for three years at this point. Reports that Apple's next gen phone will support faster Wi Fi, support for 5G. This is pretty great because the original iPhone didn't even ship with 3G. <laughs> it took Apple a few years to support 4G. New iPhone 11 camera leak, super selfies, and triple rear camera setup. <laughs> If they're gonna do the triple camera, it's definitely an interesting look. It's very similar to the Huawei Mate 20 Pro phone, and I don't know. It's just like a thing. It's just, it's just, I don't know whose video is this. Oh, it's everything Apple Pros. Hello, friend. Um, <laughs> it's, what are, you, what are you saying? I leave for a couple weeks and I come back and I don't understand Apple anymore. <laughs> I feel like that's kind of my same thought too. I was gone traveling for the holidays and I hop back on Twitter and I look up Apple rumors and it's just like, what has happened? They came out with charging cases, rumors of 500 cameras in the back. This is realistically what I would like the next iPhone to look like. I'll tell you though, those gold, that gold phone looks really really good. So if we do want to go with this three camera setup, I mean, can we just like put them all three in a line here just like that? I just don't know. I don't even know. I'm making this video and I'm just getting super confused about my feelings. Like, I don't know what I like. Like, what are you? What is this? Oh my goodness. What are you doing? What is this? What? What are you? What, what, what is this? What is this? Oh my God. This is actually what I was just thinking about is the three camera. <laughs> this is also interesting. Putting this in the center like that. It's a very, I mean, it seems like putting the camera in the center is a very common thing in most phones, so it's really not that absurd. Like, look at that. That's just, that's a look. That's something. Like, how many freaking, one, two, there's four. There's four, four freaking cameras. Do we need any more? We do. Oh, what's this? What are you? The same exact thing, but the cameras are moved over. I don't know what to think. I don't know what to feel. I mean, what are you? What are you? That's more along the lines of something that I was thinking. <laughs> so I definitely think one of the things that I have hopes for in the future of the next iPhone is a better front facing camera. I would love, 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 love to see it finally be 4K because I do film a lot of my videos on my phone and when I'm switching from the front to the back, it doesn't make that huge of a difference, but when you are shooting all 4K content and then you mix in front facing footage from your phone, that's sort of where you see the huge difference. So it will be really exciting to see what they do with that because I think improving the front facing camera is definitely a huge step forward. So anyway, these are some of the renders that I've seen and <laughs> like, I don't know, man. I don't know. What's it gonna be? Also something that's interesting is the hole punch design for front facing cameras. I don't know if I'm a huge fan of it. It's like, where are you gonna put it? I do like the concept of the sliding flip up front facing cameras. Like that's kind of cool because it is a way that you can have an all screen front and not have to worry about where you're gonna put the front facing camera. I can't really see Apple doing that, but I feel like at some point they're gonna have to do something super drastic, super crazy where people are like, you did what? Oh, you remove the headphone jack, which I'm still a fan of. I totally do not miss the headphone jack at all. 
I have AirPods. I have so many various wireless headphones that at this point, the only time that I ever need wired headphones is when I'm out shooting and I need to monitor audio. So that's basically it. But other than that, those are some of the phones that I've seen. So I also wanna say a huge shout out to a bunch of the artists who have rendered these things too, because you guys are super talented and I think it's incredible to see the way that people perceive things that they wanna see in the future. Be sure to leave me some comments below and let me know what you think the next iPhone will have. What will the next iPhone be named? I don't think it's gonna be called the iPhone 11 for some reason, but I'm, I'm not sure. I have zero insight. I don't know anything. I am purely sitting here on my computer Googling things. All of the things that I have seen here, you guys also have access to. I'm just kind of curating it. So this is not secret information. It's freaking Google. I'll see you guys in my next video. Also, I've been enjoying this battery case a lot more than I thought. Okay, I'll see you guys later. I'm gonna go edit this video now. Bye.